Okay, so supposing we have two bank accounts, uh, this is auto demo data. I just created a bank euro account because he, by default he has a bank, which is USD since the default currency for the demo data in auto is USD. So I created a bank euro, and if you uh, check, I just uh, well, I just created a, a new account for euros and I set the type of the journal also for bureaus and the type of the account uh, the type of the account also is set for the currency euro that it is because it's different from the one in the company so now I can just go here and um, do an internal transfer I already have one here I'll just use this one so this is an internal transfer yet to confirm and suppose I'm going to take money from so I have zero in euros and I have 5000 in USD so I'm going to take a thousand USD and send them to euro account so when I save and I confirm this is what I will got I will got 861 that's the today's rate for USD so of course the bank has two rates usually to buy and to sell so they earn money when they're doing those those currency exchanges and it's really not an exchange rate so we can in my perspective it doesn't make sense to go into the system and say force this transfer uh, rate because it's really not real it's the transfer rate plus what the bank is going to earn so what makes sense is just do the transfer as we did and now of course if you open your bank account the bank will take money from the transfer let's suppose you only got it 800 euros so you can go here and you and you do a bank statement and create and you see transfer um, you had the date TRX and so we only got 800 we didn't got the 860 save now we reconcile so let's find that money income here add it to this line and now we say this is really a bank fee okay so the 6192 that's for the bank reconcile and okay yeah there are the statements so now you can see you have 800 euros and not the 860 as uh, would be the, the real date exchange rate. So that's all, thanks.